Today we're going to talk about our drive block progression. This consists of a series of drills. The first two, leopards and crowbar, really emphasize it on getting the defender going backwards and suffocating him, getting our hips onto his hips. Then we'll add some of the footwork to it. We'll take our first step, then work a second step on command, bringing our hands, knee, and hips all forward on the second step, making contact then. And then we'll drive the defender straight on 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 the set hit. Then we'll work a double board drive, just working on finishing, working the length of two boards, then work something we'll call assist, which is where we have somebody else helping the defender not get moved backwards. So first drill we have is lepers, starting off in a bent knee position, both hands twice behind the back. This guy had a little bit of shoulder problem, so we're going to get the uh, other one behind there. But we want to put our Rydell all right, just underneath his Rydell. And we'll start driving our knees forward. Once we have the defender going backwards, we'll work to get our hips onto his hips and suffocate the block. And you see, in order to maximize efficiency, our next defender, he'll step in right here for the next guy blocking. So again, this is what we call lepers because we're working without without arms and then we'll work crowbar same idea we want to get the knees going forward and then suffocate putting our hips onto his hips but now we're working on lifting the defender out of the ground so we're pressing into his ribs and then lifting him out of the ground as the defender pushes down on us so knees coming forward working on getting our hips on his hips to suffocate and again the next defender working in for the next offender. A little too much emphasis on the lift there, but I like the idea of getting these going forward and then driving the hips through. Then we'll work one step to strike. So we're working on going lower to lower with our first step. We're just loading the hands. We don't want to bring them back at all. Just loading them, getting them ready to strike, bringing this knee, the hips, the hands all forward on the second hit. Then a the third one, we'll be working through. And again, driving the knees forward, working on suffocating our hips onto his hips. The next defender work, working in. And then we'll do it to the left. This is in season. More, normally we have more guys working at once, but it's kind of late in the year, so we're just working, just working two lines here. So again, first step, low to lower with the with the left foot, the right knee working forward as we make contact. Pause in there just to check the fit. Then we're rolling through. Knee drive. And suffocation. Then we'll all go through. And this is in training camp. So we're all working at the same time here. All right, so low to lower on the first step. Second step, the knee going forward. Trying to get our hips onto the defenders. Another example of drive all the way through. Again, now we're later in the year. All working. Uh, on two boards, you see one of our tight ends, two of our tight ends here working together. That's pretty good. First step, low to lower. Second step, right knee coming forward, suffocating, getting the hips onto the hips. This is double board drive. So, again, we're just checking finish here. We want to make sure that we're driving and lifting and suffocating the whole length of two boards. Then this is what we call assist. If you can't tell what's going on here, film comes in a little bit late here. But we've got a blocker, a ball holder here, and an assister standing behind the defender. Instead of hitting the sled, we'll do something like this, where you're trying to drive two guys out of there. Great job on the rightmost line here as you're looking at it. Getting the knees working forward. Hips on hips, driving all the way through the block. Now we'll look at it in game action. All right, taking a look at the left guard here. Putting together a lot of things we just talked about. First step, going low to lower. Second step, that right knee working vertical. Let's see the hands a little bit tighter on the punch. But knees going forward. Work to get his hips onto the defender's hips. And we're in pretty good shape there. Well, that's our drive block progression. Hopefully you got something out of that. 
there's anything we do for you, let us know. thank you.